Meanwhile, Taiwan Statistics Bureau has sharply downgraded its GDP growth projection for the year to 1.61 percent, citing a weak export performance and lower-than-expected private investment. That's Taiwan's lowest growth forecast in nearly eight years. However, officials think that as inventory destocking gradually comes to an end and AI applications become more popular, exports won't decline so much in the future. The delayed effects of tightening monetary policy continue to interfere with things. The center of gravity of post-pandemic consumption has shifted to services and the momentum of foreign trade has cooled. In addition, last year's base was relatively high, which affected the performance of our exports. In the second half of the year, inventory destocking will come to an end. In addition, the rise of AI applications will lead to an increase in demand for server-related industries. But in one sentence, there is light at the end of the tunnel. The Statistics Bureau believes that the AI craze will be felt in Taiwan's economy, which could grow by up to 3.32% in 2024. Meanwhile, officials say commodity prices won't rise too dramatically in the remainder of the year. The Bureau revised its annual CPI prediction down to 2.14%, 0.12 percentage points lower than its forecast back in May.